All right, guys. So doing some rift running here right now on T2 with the cane set, and I'm trying to see um, what the difference is, uh, magic, um, you know, loot, loot wise. So far, I haven't got a single drop in this rift, and I've killed uh, an absolute ton of elite packs, and I haven't got any drops. So. What I'm going to do after this run through the rift is I'm going to switch over to T3, throw on some different gear, and see which is yielding more. And I'm thinking T3 without the uh, magic find will. I don't think I can do T3 with the magic find gear on. I really don't. I suppose we could try. But uh, I don't think I can handle it. Probably open like 15 chests in the first area too and no drops. Not to mention all the elites I killed. Very annoying. Another elite pack. Come on. Be generous. I know you want to be generous, Blood Clan Warriors. through here so the uh, minions can get more attacks in. Wow, you just Blood Clan Warriors are stingy, apparently. Keeps shooing me away. I hate that knockback crap. <laughs> He's almost down. There we go. And no drops. Actually, uh, quite annoyed with this rift that I haven't gotten anything in here. I hate this town. <laughs> Survivor's Enclave is the best town now. Everything's just in the perfect spot. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> T3. With the magic fine gear. Trash should still pose no real threat. the elites that I'm worried about. These guys are very beefy. That's okay. It just means he's going to allow me to spawn more fetish. And where's Here we go. Here's some elites. Exactly what I'm looking for. Let's see how fast it actually these guys aren't going down too badly. The real question is, is it gonna make a big difference? Because we need the loot, man. We need the loot. Nothing. Should be a fairly decent test as to how uh, my witch doctor is faring in terms of progression. You know, if he can handle T3, then we're on the right path. More elites, excellent. See, if I put my other gear on, um, that kind of stuff won't bother me. I'll be immune to most ground effects. If 
like I said before, sometimes it just gets you get frustrated and and pissed off at the game when it's not when it's not giving you anything. Just gotta stick with it though. Like right now, I'm feeling very bummed out over not. Um, I haven't gotten anything in quite a while now. I mean, even if it's not Zoonies, you know, even if it's not what you're looking for, at least when you get something, it's, you know, it keeps pushing you forward um, to keep looking for, to keep fighting for and hoping that what you do want will drop. So when you go long periods of time without getting anything dropping at all, it, that's when things start to get frustrating in Diablo. Especially with the new uh, the new baseline for drop rates, um, you generally speaking you um, expect to be getting a lot more, and sometimes it's just not the case. Sometimes it feels like you're getting less than before they raise the uh, baseline legendary drop rate. But we're gonna push through, we're gonna keep going until we get what we're looking for, until we get something, at the, anything at this point would be nice. And we're still looking for the first piece of Zunis, we haven't found one. Um, seems like it's almost on it. For me, anyway, it seems like it's almost unattainable because I've been working on finding Zunis for quite a bit longer than when I started recording the find the search for it. Because I saw, I uh, regularly watch uh, Anthony Evans Witch Doctor videos, and uh, basically what has inspired me to want to main Witch Doctor. Um, over wizard. You don't see too many um, guys uh, really showcasing the wizard anymore on YouTube or even uh, streaming. Okay, you are the dude. You, I demand, demand a legendary drop. Come on, you're gonna give me my drop, man, whether you want to or not. Oh, this guy's tough. Because of his, uh, reflect. One measly yellow ring, come on. Like, that kind of stuff's got to piss you off, honestly. Like, you can't be happy with that, right? After this, we'll go visit Kadala. Hello, friend. I know you want to give me some drops. Oh man, I'm not going to be able to kill this guy on T3, am I? I don't have enough uh, fetishes out to kill him fast. Oh, maybe not. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. Ooh. We got a drop. That's four. But they're shitty pants. What are they? Actually, no. They're, sw they're Swampland Waders. These are really good pants. I like these pants a lot. Ooh, that's an upgrade in toughness. And if we reroll the uh, regen, that'll be an all round, like, very good upgrade. Awesome! We're gonna reroll those suckers. An upgrade's an upgrade, is an upgrade. Even if it's not what you're looking for, you can never turn your nose up at any type of upgrade in my mind. So I was actually really bummed out by uh, 
the other swamp, the swampland waders that I'm wearing, I was quite bummed out by the roll. I'm reinvigorated. I'm happy again. That's all it takes, man. One drop. One drop to get you back in the mood. Here, legendary. Here, legendaries. Hear mobs, hear mobs. Where's all the mobs? Hello, boys. The Rift Guardian. Voracity. Voracity. We all know it's gum. Come on. Standing in the poison, in a boss, no legs. What a prick. Come on, there's got to be some more drops in this in this area. Like, these guys are going to give me some drops. Come on. We're going to make a demand again, guys. I'm going to demand a dead man's finger. Yeah, you heard it here. What are you guys fighting with over there? Why is it taking you so long to kill whatever it is? Go ahead in here a little bit longer. Let me go re-roll those pants. I think this is um think about it right now, this is a little different for Diablo on YouTube. Most people don't uh, do this, you know, it's build videos and stuff like that. Uh, most people save this kind of thing for Twitch. Uh, my ISP is not too shit hot though, so Twitch is not an option for me at the moment. It used to be when I had a different ISP, but things happened with that. All right, you. Give me something. Ooh, do we got double packs here? I think we do. Gotta watch my health now. Get these guys, come on. Kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them. This guy's taking a while to go down. guys are horrible, these bugs. Nobody likes the bugs. You get one single legendary out of a rift. That's always a bummer. Three is a nice number for rifts. Especially when you're on anything over T1, you'd think that you'd really uh, have better luck with it. It's been a really long time since I've had like a really insane amount of drops in a rift. Oh, 
Okay. Okay, so that's done. We got one more legendary that makes four now, including the plans. Uh, we've got to reroll these suckers though. Oh wait, that goes in there too. Let's sell these, repair. Let's reroll these pants. And we want to get rid of the regen, right? Because that's gonna give us a socket. Can get a socket out of that, eh? No. So, regenerates 882 life per second is fucking useless, guys. And there's one socket. We need two. Come on, sockets. Ah, oh, really? Holy shit. They're still better. Oh, man, how do I keep running out of that stuff? Costs so much to reroll. <laughs> Probably get rid of these ones now. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of those ones. Okay, well, that's still better. That's still an upgrade. Okay, let's go uh, close this. And what do we got to work with? 143. Can we get a freaking Zunimasa's mojo? I'm gonna close my eyes. Not even one legendary. Not even one. Not a single one. You bitch. Oh wait, don't sell these. I need the... Gotta start uh, salvaging again. Okay, I'm not looking. Why do you keep? Ooh, why do I keep getting these things? They drop for me all the time. Ugh. It's not a bad mojo. It really isn't. I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm gonna hold on to it in case I ever decide to do something with, uh, like, Grasp of the Dead. It's already got Grasp of the Dead damage on there. It's got good mana regen on it. <sighs> That's seriously just very annoying, though.